So, I'm going to talk about The Sims 3 on the Steam Deck, on Linux, basically. The game will run and play smooth and everything, but the main focus of this video is to talk about how to install mods on The Sims 3 on the Steam Deck. So, if you want to play with mods on The Sims 3, you just download whatever mods, open up your favorite browser, download, go to whatever website you use for your mods, download whatever mods you want. Make sure you remember where to uh, put the mods, usually just put them in downloads so will be in the downloads directory close out that now here's the tricky thing the steam deck running steam os which is you know linux it uses two directories to run the game it uses the install directory, which for me, since I installed it on the SD card, it will be here. And then we go into Steam Apps. Common. And then it's right down here. You have the install directory, which is technically where the games exe is going to be or where the exe should be yeah you have the launcher exe and then you have the other directory, which is also the directory where you're going to put your mods in, which is, I'll just start over from the beginning of it anyway. So your home, start in the home directory. You also want to make sure that you turn on show hidden files. So you can get the local folder to show up on that. So home, local, share. You want to go to Steam. And then Steam Apps. Compact Data. Now, you also might need another program. If you don't know what the game ID for The Sims 3 is, you can just go to the Discover Store. Open it up and search for a program called Proton Tricks. And open that up. Set it up to work with your SD card. And whatever other storage devices you use for games. And you will see the game ID for each game that you have. As for The Sims 3, it's 47890. Which is right here. Click on that. PFX. Drive underscore C. Users. Steam user. My documents, electronic arts, the Sims 3, and mods. Now, you will have to run the game first in order for it to populate this directory so that you can add the mods folder and all that stuff. You just go in here, then you have your override, your packages. And your resource.config. I have these mods. 
which are basically the two mods that come with the uh, the resource or the yeah the mod frame the mod framework folder that you could download from mod the sims I recommend no more than these as cuz when if you download more then the game starts to the performance starts to get impacted and you start taking frame rate drops cuz I used to try to do you know CC and some adult mods but you know it got too chug it got too chugging so I just keep it here that way the game runs smooth as you saw in my other video and I really ain't had no problems with it the error message I believe is due to this mod the black UI mod I'm just sorry that the default blue just grew stale. But, uh, yeah, I'm on the Steam Deck. The Steam Deck runs games using two directories for most games anyway. You have the install directory and the compact data directory. You need both of those directories to run most games. Unless it's a native Linux game, meaning that it has a, a version of itself that can run on the Steam Deck natively without using Proton. And then that game will just have one directory for everything. But other than that, you'll be using a game with Proton and you'll have two directories that are important. Now I know for Windows PCs, the mod directory is just, you know, you open up your start menu and go to my directories or my documents, sorry, and then Electronic Arts, The Sims 3 mods. But Linux doesn't quite have that set up. We have sort of something similar to Windows Start Menu, but it's called the Application Launcher. And that's it. I mean, it's how you download mods and install them. You just get, you just open up your favorite web browser, go to your favorite site to get Sims 3 mods, and download whatever mods you want and extract them to the mods directory. You will have to run the game once though, as I said earlier, in order for it to populate the directory you need. I was, I was making this video in response to a Steam thread Because someone, someone's information was a bit inaccurate. So I just decided to help them out. By showing them that they can indeed play The Sims 3 on the Steam Deck. And with mods, without taking too much of a performance hit. And I was running... My game in my last video at high graphic settings. 